Another question from Dan. Damn, Dan has been quiet. Now look at him. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, next, uh, he says, your comments on this would be cool. I've added an SSL certificate to my site and I'm having issues with some links showing an error. Yep, that'll happen. I'm surprised you didn't lose a bunch of images too. And it'll screw up sometimes uh, JavaScript and uh, CSS and all kinds of stuff. I'm told that if I have to deal with these links before my full padlock appears, uh, I'm stumped to trying to fix this. Any recommendations? Yeah. All right. Um, typically, whenever I've had to convert a site from non-SSL to SSL, I've gone to Upwork and just found somebody that specializes in that kind of stuff and then just hired them. And literally, because they'll come from, you know, the Philippines and stuff like that. I mean, I just say, look, I got 50 bucks for this job. And I, and I, I mean, I just offer 50 bucks right off the bat. I mean, you, you could probably get it for even a lot less, but I just say this, uh, and you know, I post a job, say I got a WordPress site. I just switched it over to SSL. I'm having some issues with some images or some scripts or something like that. What, whatever the issue is, I explain it and I say, I got 50 bucks. I just need somebody to go in and fix this for me. And that's it. And I pay somebody to do it and I let them do it. Um, Cause I actually spent a bunch of time trying to figure all that shit out on my own. And then I realized that my time is better use, uh, better spent trying to make money instead of fixing WordPress code. <laughs> so find some uh, data nerd on Upwork that can do that for you and just spend a few bucks and get it done and uh, problem solved. And then bookmark that person so that the next time you run into that issue, you can just contact them again. Uh, if anybody else wants to tell them how to do it personally or how to do it himself, feel free. <laughs> but I say hire that stuff out. Agreed. Okay, very good. Also, if you have a good host, like Liquid Web, a lot of times Liquid Web will, again, if you have a good host, which every one of you on here should, guys, stop using cheap hosts, period. I'm telling you, stop using cheap hosts. If your sites aren't ranking, there's a good, or it's, it's a good um, possibility that it's because of your host, or, or that might be one of the main reasons. And there's an absolute um, correlation between shitty hosts and, and problems with sites not ranking and all kinds of stuff, guys. And not only that, but the support sucks for most of those cheap or uh, inexpensive hosts. And so I know like Liquid Web will a lot of like, because uh, I, I use them a lot. I'm also using WPX hosting, which is um, Terry Kyle's hosting. And it's really good too. Their support is amazing over there too. Um, and so typically if I have an issue, I just contact support and ask them. And they'll fix a lot of SSL stuff for you too. If you've got, again, if it's a good host. If it's a budget host, forget it. Good luck with that. Liquid Web, man. Liquid Web. Everyone, Liquid Web. I, I, don't, I've, I haven't used the, the WPX, Terry Kyle stuff. Liquid Web, I wouldn't change them for the world. And fortunately for SSL stuff, we have a Caesar. Yeah. Well, and what's great is now, uh, you know, you get free SSL certificates with WPX and Liquid Web. So whenever you install a new site, it automatically upgrades it to and installs SSL for you. And you don't even have to worry about it. And since it's new, everything, and it got installed that way, your WordPress site, go, then everything just works right for the first time. It's when you have to convert an existing site to SSL that you run into issues. Okay. Uh, 